We've now come to the end of week seven, 21 bedroom baller sessions. I started today with a warm up, working with a football and a tennis ball, using the technique kick, swap and catch with the hand-eye coordination. We then had Jack that taught us a V, L turn and a chop. Jaden taught us a reverse chop and roll back, which is one of my favorite skills of the series. I then worked on a skill. You throw, control, push it out, and we do Jaden's reverse chop and roll. And then finally, we done a reverse chop, flick and catch. 21 sessions in, bedroom ballers, see you Saturday. So you're only gonna concentrate on doing a kick up with the football, but you do a kick up with your stronger foot, pass the tennis ball or your toy into the other hand, then bring it back. Kick up, move across. Kick up, move across. Kick up, move the ball across. So you're now concentrating on two different things. You're always doing a kick up with a football, but you're just moving the tennis ball or the object into the other hand. Okay, now with the tennis ball, kick it, swap, catch. So you kick the tennis ball, swap the football and catch it. Kick, swap, catch. And all you're going to do, kick, swap, catch. And then it's swapping every time. Kick, swap, catch. So you're going from a football to a tennis ball. Football to a tennis ball. Football to a tennis ball. I'm nine years old and I support Liverpool. And you play for? EPR. Love that. Right, what's the skill today? So the skill is basically, you do a V, an L turn and then a chop. Okay, so show me full speed. V, L, chop. Oh, I love that. One more time. V, L, chop. There we go. Right, how long are we going to spend on this? Uh, 30 seconds. 30 seconds, right. Get, so, V, an L, then it's reverse. So I'm going to do it again because I've messed it up. So it's a V, an L, then it's a reverse chop. Does that make sense? My name is Jaden. I support Manchester United and, and I'm nine years old. Okay, perfect. Let's go, mate. Tell us the skill and show it to us. So it's a reverse and then roll backwards. Ooh, I like Show me a few times now. Three okay, times. Don't push it out with the reverse chop. So it is a reverse, and again, pull it out and then pull it behind you. Love that, Jake. I love that skill, mate. We're going to try that for 30 seconds. So you're not chopping it when you do a reverse. Just no. Do a reverse, tend to go forwards, and then roll it back. back. Step over with the left, push it away, and then we do Jaden's skill. So all you're doing at the start is a step over with your weaker foot. Stronger foot pushes it away, then do your turn. Okay? Yeah. Let's try that one. Brought me my new favorite, the reverse and roll. I love that one. Jalen, I love that skill. This time, what we're going to do, you throw the ball up, control it, push it, reverse and roll. Okay, so I'm going to show you again. So there's quite a lot of combinations here. Throw, control, push it out, reverse, chop, roll. One more time. Control the ball. Let me move the camera down so you can see my feet. So, you throw the ball up, control, push, reverse, roll, and bring it back. Okay? So reverse chop, and then you're going to flick it up, catch it. So, we've done the flick up and catch before, but now you're doing the reverse chop first. So, reverse chop, flick it, catch it. So, we're going to try that for 45 seconds. Reverse chop, flick, bounce, knee, catch. So you're now going to try and catch it on your knee. So that flick needs to go up. So reverse, flick, and when it bounces, you've got to try and catch it on your knees, not using your hands like what I've done. So all you're doing now, when you flick it up, you've got to try and catch it in between your knees. We're trying this for 45 seconds. As we start week eight, today we had a recap and had one guest coach. But this was the best skill combination that we've had during the last eight weeks. Zach, over to you. Swipe across to see the skill in three separate stages. Have a good weekend. Remember, from next week, we're going to be running Tuesdays and Thursdays, 12 o'clock. No more Saturday session recaps. Have a good one. Take care. Bye-bye. Zach, 
I'm nine years old and I support Manchester United in QPR. Um, I'll do the whole entire skill in one first and then I'll break it down into steps. Let's go. Okay. That's a lot to remember. Stage one, you roll, and as you roll, you step over it and then stop it with the bottom of your heel. So show me stage one three times. Show me stage one so everyone can see what stage one is. Roll, step over, stop. And again, Roll it through your legs and then stop it. And one more. Roll and stop. So you're going to stop it with your toe. Okay, 30 seconds. Three, two, one, off you go. Roll, over, stop. And again, remember, look at the screen if you're not sure. Roll and then stop it. There we go. Let's go. Some people will find it easy. Some will find it more challenging. Keep going. 15 seconds, nearly. And again, so it's a roll and then stop. And again, roll and then a stop. Five more seconds. Give it a couple goes for you. So as you stop the ball after the roll, you, you bring it out like that and then you roll it back in and push it out. So show me stage two a few times. So it is roll out and across and out. One more time. Roll, out, across, and out. Out, across, and out. Okay, we're going to try that for 30 seconds. Everyone, try just stage two for 30 seconds. If it's too difficult, just look at the screen. Three, two, one, off you go. Roll it out, roll it across, and out. So, roll it out, across, and out. So, right foot, right foot, put your right foot. So, face the bed. Yep. Yeah. Keep going. So, no, just keep trying. Keep trying. This one's a bit difficult for Theo. It's a difficult one. Roll out and across. Roll out and across. As you, as you push it out on step two, yeah. you go straight into an L turn, push it away, and cry. Okay, so show us stage three a few times. So you push it out. Out, L, cry. Show us one more time. So it's out, L, Cruyff. So all everyone's going to practice now for the next 30 seconds is pushing it, with, pushing it out, L and Cruyff. You guys should get that one. So push out, L, Cruyff. 30 seconds, off you go. Push out, L, Cruyff. Okay, so just practice that one. So you guys may have this part. Theo's got this one. Out, L, Cruyff. There we go. A Cruyff, not a chop. Keep going. And then a croif. 10 seconds. Five, four, three, Show us two, one. All three stages together. And we're going to do that for 30 seconds. Three, two, one, off you go. So it's a roll over. And there we go. Majority of you will have stage three, but it's stage one and two that's difficult. Keep going. 10 seconds. Five. Come here, Fiat. Four. Three. Two. Last one. One. Love that. Right. That's definitely one myself and Theo need to practice. Thank you very much. You're welcome. See you later, mate. Bye. Session 23 of Bedroom Ballers. I started the session with a kick-up combination. We then had two guest coaches. Our first guest coach was Henry, who taught us a skill combination of a double step over, Zidane, reverse chop. Our second guest coach was Samuel, who taught us a skill combination of a push, Zidane, L-turn, and a step over. Bedroom ballers, back again on Thursday, 12 o'clock. You're going to do right foot kick, pat it up. Kick it and pad it up. That's all you're going to be doing. You're only going to be working your right foot for 30 seconds. So you just bring it up, hold it, bring it up. Or if that's easy, you can just pat it. But it is the weaker, it is the inside of your foot only. Up there. Right, pat it up, left, pat it up. Pat, pat. So it's just a thigh and a pat. Can you change your hands 
every time. So that's all you are doing for 30 seconds. Take your time. Foot, pat, thigh, pat. Foot, pat, thigh, pat. So it's just your foot and your thigh. You decide what foot you're gonna use. You decide what thigh you're gonna use. Whatever feels comfortable for you, just your foot and your thigh. Mess it up there. Foot, thigh, pat. Foot, thigh, pat. You decide what foot and what thigh you're gonna use, but you just have to do a pat in between. Henry, my age is eight and I support QPR. Come on, you are, right. It was going to be two step over the day and the Ah, oh, love it. So it's going to be a double step over, a zidane, and a reverse chop. Show me again a couple more times. Double. We'll start again. Move it back a bit. Move it back. Move it back. There we go. Off you go. Double step over, zidane, and a reverse chop. Love it. Right. We're going to do that for 30 seconds. Okay. All I'm going to add now is we're going to do two reverse chops. So you do your double step over. You do your Zidane, then you do one reverse chop, then you do another reverse chop. Hi, my name's Samuel. I'm eight years old and I support Tottenham. Ah, oh, he and he's wearing the kit. There we go, right. Okay, so the skill's going to be, you're going to go, move it forward, Zidane, yeah. Yeah. L turn, and then step over, push it away. So step, okay, show me again then, mate. Put it all together. Zidane, yep. L turn, step over. Okay, so you're, you're now going to do a Zidane, an L turn, and now with the step over, let me move it back so you can see, the step over at the end, you go step over, inside, inside. So that's all you're adding at the end. So it will be a Zidane, step over, inside, inside.